Hurricane season, believe it or not, just two weeks away. And if we do get slammed by tropical weather this year, there is a system in place to protect people along the Hillsborough River from floodwaters. News Channel 8's Brittany Muller got a first-hand look at that system today. She joins us live in Tampa. Stacey, good evening. We're along the canal. This is where the floodwaters would be diverted to if necessary to keep residents and their homes safe. Hurricane Donna slashes up from the Caribbean into Florida. Hurricane Donna left massive flooding in 1960. To protect residents and their homes along the Hillsborough River from this devastation, the Tampa Bypass Canal was created. The district's able to close the gates on that structure, cutting off the river at that point, preventing those floodwaters from entering the cities of Tampa and Temple Terrace. The Southwest Florida Water Management District says the system is made up of five structures along the nearly 16-mile canal. Operations Bureau Chief Jerry Malam says when floodwater begins to fill up the empty reservoir, his team can use the system to divert it out into McKay Bay. Thankfully, this system was in place when Hurricane Irma hit in 2017. We were moving up to 3 billion gallons of floodwaters out of the region using the structure. But as hurricane season quickly approaches, flooding concerns and drainage issues are top of mind for Michael Maltarp, who lives along the river. I haven't been underwater yet, but I'm, I'm, you know, I'm anticipating if we have a pretty decent hurricane coming in, it's going to be, it's going to be a problem. You know, it's, it's, you know, there's nowhere for the water to go. Now, as hurricane season quickly approaches in just then two weeks, the district says that they're going to be visiting and checking out all 84 structures to make sure their systems are up and running in the event of a storm. Stacy, Brittany, how often is the system used? So last year, the system was used back in rather 2019 for two weeks during a heavy rain event, the same back in 2018. Before that, for Hurricane Irma for one month. Okay, Brittany Muller live for us in Tampa. Thank you.